Hi, Bridge. What's up? Okay. Hi, everyone. Um, this your girl, Hi, Bridge, and I'm back. Um, I know it's been a while, and and yeah, I'm sorry for that. Um, I really love YouTube. I watch YouTube, so why would I? But why wouldn't I want to come back? Anyway, um, how have you guys been? Um, yeah. I'm kind of scared to make this video, but, um, but I just thought, hey, let me jump on the pretty privileged terrain of other videos that are on YouTube. Why not? Why not? Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, so. Um, I know my channel pertains to me talking about music or the industry or me wanting to go into the industry, which is, which still rings clear, um, rings true till this day. To this day! Um, I just. I just, I don't know, because it's just crazy, um, with this pretty privileged thing. I seen, I seen, um, St I think her name is Old Stuff Co. make a video about it. I seen a couple of people make a video about it, and I was thinking, should I make a video about it? Okay, why not? Here we go. So, <clears throat> where should I start? Hmm. Okay, so some people, and I don't want to be the type of person that is like, um, I forgot what the word is, controversial, controversial, I don't want to make it very controversial, but here we go. Um, some people, I've noticed some people saying, oh, I have pretty privilege, and I don't have pretty privilege, and I have pretty privilege, and I don't have pretty privilege, but I do have pretty privilege, but I don't have pretty privilege, but do you, but do you have pretty privilege? Okay, anyway, so, um, I'm not gonna beat around the bush. I think that I'm okay. I think I'm pretty. So you agree? What? You think you're really pretty? Oh, I don't know. I think that I'm pretty. Okay, there we go. We said it. We got out. We got that out the way. Sometimes I do have, like, I do struggle with my self esteem sometimes, from time to time, and this is just me being blunt with you guys, um, because this is YouTube, so <laughs> everything you say on the platform, um, used to your own discretion, your own discretion. So, yeah, it's just like, I don't know. I will say this. When I was back in high school, middle school, elementary school, I, people didn't like me. People didn't like me like, people didn't like anything about me. They probably didn't like the way I talked, to the way that I looked, to everything of that nature. And I'm not trying to stay on here that long because it's only got 13 minutes left, but... We gonna try to knock this out the park. All right. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> I'm trying to keep on topic. Yeah. So people did not like me in in um, high school, middle school, elementary, and I don't know why <laughs> to this day. And you know, like I could only guess why. Maybe they felt a certain way about me. Maybe they felt triggered. Maybe they felt, um, they, I don't know. They probably felt triggered. They probably felt like I was, um, not a distraction. I forgot what the word is. Intimidating. I don't know. But I was going to say this, and now they're making noise outside. I was going to say this. Like, I'm damned if I do, and I'm damned if I'm damned if I don't. Like, and I'll say the reasons why. Because when 
I was going to school back then, people didn't like me. People made fun of my hair. Like I said in my other video a couple years ago, I was like, people said that, oh, why don't your hair grow to, to uh, other controversial things like, um, I could have certain people wanted to fight me at one point, but um, yeah, people just did not like me, and I clearly right now just don't want to care. But like now, I work in an environment where, whereas when I was in high school, it was the same but different because it was kind of bullying onto what they didn't like about me, and now it's like a different type of. I don't want to say bullying, but if that's the case in the workspace, like people, they don't like you, so they're gonna antagonize you by, um, what's the word, cutting you off from certain things, from being standoffish, um, being cliquish, and I'm just thinking like, I haven't done anything to anybody. And I just, I don't know, I just, <sighs> to me, I can't win. Um, I feel like still just trying to have a sisterhood, like friend, friendship sisterhood is just hard for me nowadays cause, because in high school it was hard. Um, I had a couple friends here and there, or people I thought, so thought were my friends, and now I don't talk to them at all. But, um, yeah, I don't talk to them, and now it's like I don't have the types of friends that I want, and it's kind of, I don't know if the right word is an oxymoron, but, like, I just, I... It's just hard. It really is hard. Like, I am trying all the time, um, and it's just hard. I just hope to really, you know, get out of the, um, weird, um, the weird, but just weird environment that I'm in, um, the weird place that I'm in, um, and go on to bigger and better things in my life, and... It's just, it's just, it's, it's very telling. Um, and, yeah, I think people, all their stories are valid. Um, I think my story is valid. I think what I've gone through, because I have a testimony, and I won't put it all out there on YouTube, but I know I do have a testimony. Um, I think that people just need God. Yes, um, I just, I don't know, it's just, it's crazy. And I just want to touch up on that to tell you where I stand with this pretty privileged fiasco. Um, and yeah, thank you for listening, everybody. And I'll probably be back with more videos. I don't know what I'm gonna cover, but I'll probably be, be back. And thank you for watching, thank you for tuning in, and hope to see you in the comments section. Hope to see you and interact with you guys. Um, bye, peace, have a good day. Hi Bridge, what's up?